John, you are... Simon, why don't we go when it's dark? That way we can clear the place and go, and no one will know where we are. No, it's not the right time to leave yet. What are we waiting for? Look, I've exorcised that man in there, I've anointed him, and still there's the presence of evil. It has to be cleansed. I've prayed and prayed, and I know what Jesus wants me to do. Meaning what? We have to cleanse the entire place. Yeah, I get that bit. But what I don't understand is how... I wish you would have gone with the others. I didn't want you to stay here. I wanted to get on with this on my own. I'll tell you what, I'll do a Bible reading with him, and then I'll show you exactly what I mean. Okay. Now, I'd like to talk to you for the next hour or so about humility. I think it's something you could learn a great deal about. When am I getting out of this crap, Ole? Soon. Now, Jesus was probably the greatest ever example of humility. Close the door quickly, please. What have you been doing here? Seeing as you wanted to see it right through to the end, the final casting out of evil begins tomorrow. Barry? Everything. Well, what is it? The final solution. There. Bloody hell, you're gonna blow the place to pieces with that! Why? There is no other way. We have to destroy the church. Are you sure it's the only way? Definitely. This time tomorrow, we'll be gone, and this place will be a shell. But as a shrine, it will live on in our memory forever.